What's up guys, AK with DCC train. In today's video, I'll uh, connect that uh, LTM 101 transmitter receiver by ExpressNet to Lens LZV. My, in, in, in this case, will be my older command station. I'm just showing you my next step will be clarification on, on update using that panel, okay? Let's start it with um, update. Last broadcast that video, I got some comments, <laughs> and uh, let me clarify. So, this module, uh, the whole system, not required version four, usually point zero. We will just go like three point six, three point eight. So this thing will work with three point uh, six which is my older command station and I have a cable from ExpressNet for our test, okay? So this update is only working with LZV200, the port right here, okay? And I have uh, one command station. If I'm not selling it before, before I will probably update it to version four with that memory stick, I hope but they selling quick <laughs> the box uh, of that panel panel by itself like flash plate and um, some screws oh more important that cable very nice all right so as i said before that's the cable from my command station coming here let's connect it all right and um, so it's already start working but we'll do through the via that panel thing okay so that's the panel connecting this guy here has a led okay then after all communication connection actually i will have i believe uh, three extra ports so you can plug in in here and then plug into the trans transmitter receiver can be four um, wire cable because this is my Rocco. This is, I believe, from Zemo. Anyway, it's required only for uh, four signal, two for signal, and two for power. Okay, here we go. When it's nothing connected, it's flashing like this. I found some kind of timeout. Um, my, I sometimes I'm not turning the system, and I'm coming back after like several hours. Usually, I'm turning it in. Oh turning the system off but if it's not you just uh, re recycle power and it should work the command the throttle just sitting like trying to connect but here we go it will connect in about eight nine seconds if you have more which is i'll bring another one in a minute see it's all good so that's another one Connecting. And if sometimes it has um, another like light delay, just maybe another second if it's on the same address. But um, no problem at all. I have uh, my Russian locomotive. Let's see. Side camera see the lights on i can change directions with this button upside down but that's doesn't matter see blow the horn just small fragment turn the sound on lower i lower the sound on purpose it's a little bit uh, too loud and 
changing directions. There you go. I can take, I can steal that engine immediately. Let's lower it speed. Okay, it's still moving. Okay. 13, 31, enter. It's flashing now. Check this out. I already, already took it. So be careful when it's flashing, that indicates somebody running that locomotive. There we go. Changing direction with this throttle. Works. All right. I hope this clarify everything about that new LH one hundred one R wireless throttle and receiver transmitter. Thanks for watching, supporting business. Uh, we really appreciate it. If you guys want to support channel, there is a join membership button under every single video. Have a good one. Bye bye.